My Home is a customizable dashboard page to provide users with links to their courses and activities within them, such as unread form posts and upcoming assignments. You can use this My Home dashboard to show only your most recent courses instead of having to scroll through all of the courses you previously taught. The My Home is, is your personal customized dashboard, so each user will have their own, so students won't necessarily have your dashboard if you customize, the, if you customize your own. So let me, there's two ways to get into My Home. So over here in the left navigation block is the actual link to My Home, and there's also My Courses. Either one will take you to there. So up here you'll see that I have three courses listed. I have nine hidden. So I'm going to show all courses. And the course that I want to bring to the top is Fall 2015 Tutorials. So up here at the top, I'm going to customize this page. And within the three courses I want to display, I want to display the Fall 2015 Tutorials. So I'll click Show All. I'm going to hover over the cross and I'm going to click and drag up. You might have to scoot your page down if you're on a smaller monitor. Click and drag up. I'll bring one more up. So now you can kind of see the icons. This is for an assignment that needs attention, uh, for new form posts that haven't been read. This is for an upcoming chat session. So I want to show only this three and not worry about the remainder, the other courses that I have. So I'll click this drop down again. So now I only have four that I really want to pay attention to. The other thing you can do in the My Home dashboard is you can add blocks. So over here you'll click the drop down and let's say I want to add a calendar. Now you can see that our calendar is here in our dashboard. Again, this is only customized per user, so each person can customize this. Now, if I wanted to remove this, I can just click on the X. And now I've deleted my block. After you're done customizing this page, go back to Stop Customizing This Page button, and then your sets. And that's it.